Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new to my channel, my name is Leo, or you guys can call me Baby Scorpio. And in today's pick a card reading, this is going to be what does the universe want you to know right now? So this was a requested reading from Cha Cha Twenty Three Twenty One. So thank you so much for your request, love. With that being said, I have three piles for you guys. The first pile is going to be Green Adventuring, and it looks like this. The second pile is going to be Carnelian, and it looks like this and the last pile is going to be smoky quartz and it looks like this so i will have the timestamps down below in the comment section so you guys can check them out from there or you guys can choose your pile slash piles in the next clip so let's get it let's go y'all so again pile number one is going to be green adventuring pile number two is going to be carnelian and pile number three is going to be smoky quartz I'm gonna give you guys time to meditate. And we're gonna get into pile number one. Hey, pile number one, welcome to your reading. So before I get into your card or anything, I'm gonna tell you why you chose this green adventuring crystal. With this crystal, I'm getting that you guys could be a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. I'm getting you guys could have heavy Cancer energy in your chart. I'm also getting that you guys could have Aries or Leo placements. I'm also getting that you guys could be a Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo, or even have air placements in your chart. So. Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius, I'm getting that you guys could have heavy Gemini placements in your chart. But with this crystal, I'm getting that you guys could be in need of some balance in the heart chakra. So Spirit is saying, make sure that you guys are cleansing out your energy daily or make sure that you are cutting off any people, places, or energies that do not serve you at this time. Spirit is saying that you guys may have a lot of people that are coming out of your life as of right now. And it's just to cleanse up your energy so that you guys can receive your manifestations, okay? So you guys have been manifesting a lot. I'm getting that you guys could be journaling, you guys could be saying your affirmations or saying things out loud, or you guys could be visually looking at something, so a vision board, so you guys could be visionaries. I'm getting that you guys could be doing something to manifest something in your life. And the reason why certain things are coming out of your life is because it's making room for the things that you guys want to have in your life. So Spirit is saying you guys need to level up on your mind Set and see what you guys need to heal in order to move forward so release any limited beliefs in order to move forward in your present moment and also continue to be more present and more mindful in your present moment so spirit is saying like cleanse your energy from this past energy like let go of the past in order to move forward in your present moment i'm getting like this heavy cancer energy of where you guys need to cleanse your emotions or be grounded in your emotions in order to move forward and not be over emotional when things or people places and situations happen to you because things are not happening to you things are happening for you at this time okay so with that being said let's get into your overall energy and i use the moonlight oracle deck and it says diana is the flowing one it's mother goddess of forest people and fairies so spirit is saying stay grounded within yourself before you try to move forward in your present moment because if you try to move forward in your present moment without being grounded things are going to fall apart so spirit is saying you need to find this inner balance in yourself or you try to find it within somebody else or something else or even like a relationship it could be like romantic or platonic spirit is saying you need to find that balance within yourself before you start to look for it within somebody else because Otherwise, the relationship is going to be codependent and then it's going to leave your life. So Spirit is saying you need to ground yourself and have the courage to move forward in your life in order to have the success that you want come into your life, okay? Stay grounded and really step into your inner goddess or inner god in order to move forward and listen to your intuition okay your intuition is leading you to the happiness that is already within you so spirit is saying you need to find that happiness within you so that that happiness within you can be 
kind of like projected in your present moment so once you change your mindset things are going to change around you once you change your perspective the things that you guys want are going to appear or <laughs> not really appear because they're already in your present moment but you're gonna start focusing more on them the spirit is saying you're gonna start focusing on what is healthier for you when you change your mindset okay so with that being said let's get into your tarot cards and with the first card that i have i have the three of wands so you guys are moving forward in the right direction spirit is saying you guys are on the right path you need to have courage to continue to keep going in your present moment because things could be falling apart or certain foundations that are not for you or that no longer serve you are falling apart and spirit is saying those foundations either needed to be rebuilt or they needed to be cleansed in order for you guys to move forward in a more stable foundation okay so at this time you guys need to have the willpower to keep going and keep your emotions in check keep yourself in this calm energy so that you guys can think clearly about the next step that you guys are about to take okay because this next chapter that you guys are coming into or that you guys are stepping into requires a lot of patience and calmness of the mind and the body. So once you guys figure out how you guys would feel when having your manifestations or how you guys would feel when you guys are already in the situation that you guys want to be in, then embody that energy and continue to move forward in that energy, okay? So Spirit is saying embody the person that you guys want to become. Practice who you guys want to become and take little steps to become the person that you guys want to become, okay? And with the next card, I have the High Priestess. So you guys' intuition is on point and at certain points in your intuition, you guys doubt yourself. So Spirit is saying stop doubting yourself because you guys know what the situation is instead of what you guys want to see it for. So you guys may be seeing a person for who they are and you guys may be thinking like you guys are being too harsh on that person. But Spirit is saying you guys are not being too harsh. You're seeing the truth in the situation and you guys need to move forward with knowing that information. Like you guys need to protect your peace and continue to move forward without this person or continue to move forward in like a wiser way. Okay, because you guys know what you guys are seeing. Like you guys know the situation for what it is instead of the situation for what you guys have seen it in the past. Like maybe in the past you guys had rose colored glasses on and now you guys are seeing clearly about the situation. So we're just saying continue to see clearly about the situation or situations so that you guys can move forward in a very balanced way, okay? So you guys are really cleansing yourself from a lot of people, situations and things that are no longer serving you in order to increase this happiness within yourself because i'm already getting that you guys have a lot of opportunities coming to you and you guys see that and your path is being cleansed because you guys really see what you guys want for yourself and you guys are starting to see the people for who they are instead of seeing the people for what you guys wanted them to be for you and with the next card i have the four of pentacles the spirit is saying continue to work on the projects that are going to help you gain this financial freedom that you guys want and it doesn't mean that you guys have to quit your job it just means that you guys could do both and we're just saying when you guys realize that you guys can do both and when you balance your time out correctly it's going to be easier for you guys to move forward and you definitely have to have willpower in this new chapter in your life because it's going to be a lot but spirit is saying you guys can handle it and that's why a lot of people are coming out of your life or a lot of situations or just things are starting to kind of seem crazy at this time but spirit is saying it's mostly because you guys are manifesting something bigger and people that are coming out of your life are not meant for this next chapter or they're not meant for you guys to have in your life as of right now because they would try to sabotage it so spirit is saying be mindful of that so do not try to hold on to these people when you guys know that you guys are worthy of this new chapter in your life okay 
And with the next card, I have the card, the Five of Cups in Reverse. So you guys are definitely coming into this new chapter in a more emotionally mature way. Like you guys are becoming more mature and you're starting to look at the situation for, again, what it is instead of what you guys want to see. You guys are becoming a lot more empathetic or you guys could be an empath. So you guys need to definitely cleanse your energy daily or definitely cleanse yourself from a lot of this pain from the past and spirit is saying turn that pain into power so you guys need to step into your optimism in order to move forward in your present moment in this more powerful energy because you guys already have the power within you it's more so like you're using that energy to think on things from the past and spirit is saying you're past that like you need to move past that okay because everything is working out in your present moment and spirit is saying step into this more emotionally mature energy because if you do that things are going to start aligning with you okay like you're already in alignment but spirit is saying like you step out of alignment when you start to think about the past in like a way of where you start to fall into this like victim mentality. The situation is not happening to you anymore and so it's best for you to move forward and use that pain as like motivation to get to a different place in your life in your present moment okay once you take that step to move forward you're already in a better place than when you were in the past so with the next card i have the four of swords so spirit is saying somebody here needs to rest and rejuvenate themselves especially so that you guys can listen to your intuition okay so i'm getting that maybe your intuition has been cloudy or maybe you guys haven't been able to tell the difference between your intuition and then your ego the spirit is saying you guys need to rest and rejuvenate yourself in order to tell the difference between the two and once you guys are able to tell the difference between the two, you guys are able to get that clarity and move forward in your present moment. So the spirit is saying, take care of your mind, body, and soul at this time. You guys need to balance yourself by taking care of yourself, practicing self-care, doing something that is putting you in this more mindful energy, okay? You guys need to get a lot more present so that you guys can see the opportunities that you guys have. And in order to do that, you guys need to rest and rejuvenate yourself, okay? And with the next card, I have the Eight of Pentacles. So you guys have a lot of creative endeavors that you guys need to go towards because they're going to help you create this financial stability. So Spirit is saying continue to work on those projects because they're going to pay off in the long run, okay? It may not be something that seems to be working out right now, but Spirit is saying if you guys continue on your journey and use different strategies that actually work, it's going to help out in the long run, okay? So Spirit is saying find the strategy that works and Spirit is saying that's what you guys need to be doing right now is finding a strategy that truly works for your creative endeavors so that you guys can get yourself out of this job that you guys don't like or get yourself out of this mindset that you guys don't like. So Spirit is saying continue to create but you guys need to rest and rejuvenate yourself in order to get these ideas to create, okay? Because I'm getting that you guys are working, working, working but you guys need to rest in order to balance yourself okay like you guys need to have a balance between your work and home life in order to move forward in your present moment with willpower and with the next cards from the priestess of light oracle deck i have the card healing the heart it says the power of self-love so with this card i'm getting that you guys need to practice self-love at this time and like i said before do not try to look for something that you guys already have within yourself spirit is saying attracted because when you guys try to look for it it's saying that you guys don't have it within you and spirit is saying you guys already have what you're looking for within you so if you attract it you're already saying I have this within me and i would like to see it within somebody else instead of saying i need this okay? spirit is saying change the words i need into i deserve this okay in in order to say that you're worthy of it spirit is saying if you're trying to attract a relationship or somebody even if it's like a platonic relationship embody the energy of how you guys want that person to treat you if you guys do not treat yourself correctly you're teaching that person how not to treat you 
by the way that you guys treat yourself. The Spirit is saying a lot of your relationships have been reflections of how you guys treat yourself. And you guys need to work on your self-love in order to attract better relationships, okay? Not all your relationships, but a lot of your relationships, okay? So with the next card i have the card twin flames it says soul partner and eternal connection so you guys are definitely attracting somebody that is on your level romantically platonically it could be like family wise but you guys are attracting somebody that is worth your time and what you guys need to do is practice self-love at this time in order to again attract this person into your life instead of trying to um, control the situation like spirit is saying stop trying to control the situation because the more you try to control the situation the more that it's going to get pulled out of your life so release your control and allow things to happen and spirit is saying as you continue to move forward in your life do not wait on somebody actually live your life and practice self-love accept the time that you guys have by yourself in order to move forward in this more courageous way and spirit is saying like luck is on your side okay you guys are creating your own luck when you guys practice self-love okay and with the next card i have the card hostilities this is conflict and unrest so this energy from the past could have you guys not sleeping or just feeling very uneasy about your life or feeling very uneasy about like different people, situations, and Spirit is saying you guys need to let that go in order to cleanse yourself from these people, situations, and energies. I'm hearing like even prosperity. So Spirit is saying not all money is good money. So make sure you guys remember that when you guys are taking opportunities. Spirit is saying make sure you guys are reading the contract correctly before you guys sign anything. That's a message for somebody so that you guys do not have any conflict in the future, okay? So Spirit is saying reading is very fundamental and it's very important when it comes to whatever you guys are trying to do especially when it comes to something creatively so you guys need to read the contract you guys also need to pay attention in your present moment especially when you guys are signing something okay it could be a lease a mortgage it could be i'm getting like something for your car i'm also getting it could be like for a job so we're just saying make sure you know what you're signing up for before you just sign your name on the dotted lines because it could cause you a lot of stress in the future if you guys do not read what you guys are signing up for okay and with the power of love oracle card i have the card transformation so you guys are going through a major transformation in your life and things are happening for you and they're not happening to you so spirit is saying remember that so you guys may be very worried about your future and spirit is saying there's nothing to worry about in your future if you guys continue to move forward in your highest good if you're doing the best that you guys can every single day you guys are in alignment okay there's nothing that you guys need to worry about so the illusion that you guys need to release are these limited beliefs that you guys are not moving forward in your highest good or you're not in alignment and spirit is saying you are and you guys need to just relax okay because you're doing the best that you guys can and the best that you guys can is working out for you okay and with the moonology cards i have the card Hold your vision. So Spirit is saying there may be obstacles in your life right now, but you guys have full capability of overcoming these obstacles in your life. There's nothing that can stop you from receiving what you guys truly deserve or desire in your life but you so spirit is saying when you guys feel like you're not worthy of your manifestations you guys might be self-sabotaging so spirit is saying release that energy of self-sabotage and step into that energy of self-love so that you guys can realize what you're worthy of okay and with the next card add the card the energy is gaining momentum so spirit is saying you guys need to be the leader in your friend group or in your relationship or even in your life like spirit is saying you guys need to step into your leadership energy because you guys are making a lot of progress in your life when you guys step into your leadership energy it's not to say that you guys don't need guidance or anything like that but spirit is saying a good leader knows when to take guidance from other people you're just saying a good leader also knows when to lead so you guys need to balance yourself in that energy okay like know when to lead know when to follow and 
know who to follow as well so you guys need to reevaluate who you guys are following it could be like on social media too like maybe you guys need to cleanse out the people that you guys are following like if these people do not motivate you guys to do better then you guys need to reevaluate that and cleanse that energy from your timeline because maybe that's holding you back or slowing you down so spirit is saying be mindful of that and with the next card, add the card, your commitment is being tested. So you guys are definitely in this test in your life that you guys need to overcome, that you guys can overcome. And Spirit is saying, like, continue to take those baby steps because you guys may not see the progress that you guys want as of right now, but you guys need to move forward in the best way that you guys can as of right now because everything is paying off. You guys never know who is watching, and so you guys need to continue to keep going in your present moment and with the last card add the card drowning so you guys may be very afraid of where you guys are right now or very afraid that things are not working and you guys may see certain people have your manifestations before you and it's not to say that you guys are jealous or anything like that but you guys know that you guys have been in the game for a very long time and so you're like i deserve that as well so spirit is saying embody that energy embody already having what you guys want and being grateful for where you guys are right now because everything is working out in your favor okay we're just saying do not drown in your emotions do not allow your emotions to control the situation because you guys are very much in your power and you guys need to use your power for the greatest good of you so with that being said that was you guys this reading if this reading resonated with you guys make sure to comment down below if you guys are going to choose another pile i will see you soon but if you guys are going to click off this reading make sure you guys like share and subscribe to my channel see you guys next time and bye y'all hey pile number two welcome to your reading so before i get into your cards or anything i'm gonna tell you why you chose this carnelian crystal with this crystal i'm getting that you guys could be a fire sign so aries leo or sagittarius or you guys could be a water sign so pisces cancer or scorpio i'm getting that you guys could have heavy cancer placements in your chart but i'm getting that you guys are moving forward in your present moment but you guys don't feel like the work that you guys are doing is enough and spirit is saying you are enough and you guys are doing enough okay you guys may be doing a little bit too much that's what spirit is saying like you guys may be doing a little bit too much to the point of where it's draining you and you guys need to rebalance yourself okay so you guys are going through this rebirth and you guys are transforming yourself into this better version of yourself and spirit is saying like with becoming a better version of yourself you guys need to balance out your mindset okay like the mindset is going to be very important especially when you guys are moving forward in your present moment and the best thing that you guys could do right now is network or step out of your comfort zone and be more social with other people because conversations that you guys have with other people could really touch them to the point of where they're spreading your name out there okay so spirit is saying remember that you are your brand spirit is saying just be mindful of that spirit is saying balance out your workload okay so spirit is saying there's something that is kind of blocking you from getting where you guys want to be because your workload isn't balanced okay so once you guys get your workload balanced or back into balance you guys are going to be able to move forward in a very freeing way okay but you guys are heavily motivated and spirit loves that okay and with your overall energy i use the moonlight oracle card and i have the card armedius it says goddess of light and divine protector so you guys are definitely protected especially when you guys are working on whatever project that you guys have in place right now or even working on yourself okay so spirit is saying you guys need to get back into alignment and feel good about your body feel good about your mind body and soul okay you guys are on the right path and i'm getting that you guys may be too hard on yourself and spirit is saying you guys need to balance yourself or get back into alignment and stop being so hard on yourself because you guys are doing everything that you guys can as well as everything that you guys should be doing okay you guys are definitely in alignment and you guys are doing what your intuition has intended for you guys to do okay you guys are not behind 
and that's what spirit wants to like magnify for somebody that you guys are not behind so you guys do not have to work as hard because whatever is for you is always going to be for you and it's going to be there when you guys get there so spirit is saying just relax enjoy the moment like that's what spirit is pretty much trying to say is that you guys need to enjoy what you guys are doing instead of trying to just get it done like spirit is saying just enjoy what you guys are doing in your present moment because in the next like five years you may not be doing exactly what you guys are doing right now it may be something a little bit different like you guys may be still in the same path of what you guys are doing but it may be different so spirit is saying enjoy what you guys are doing right now enjoy the feeling right now in order to move forward and also journal more or journal your progress or document your progress in order to look back at it and see how far you guys have come or if you guys have documented your progress make sure that you guys are looking back and seeing how far that you guys have come okay because i'm getting that you guys could be in this imposter syndrome and you guys may be like oh i'm not doing enough or you feel like you're not doing enough because you guys may be looking at other people and seeing where they're at especially if that person is like the same age as you or even like slightly older than you or even younger spirit is saying your path is for you so what other people have going on in their lives doesn't have anything to do with you you guys can be inspired by them and spirit is saying do be inspired by them but do not compare yourself to where they're at right now because you guys never know what they had to go through in order to get there or you guys never know what they're doing to continue to stay there the so spirit is saying if you're moving forward in a path that is for your highest good like don't feel bad about where you guys are right now okay and you guys are also doing a lot of healing work so spirit is saying be patient with yourself because you guys are doing things in the way that is for your highest good instead of in the way that other people want you to do it okay so spirit is saying you're in alignment you're doing what you're supposed to do and with your tarot cards i have the card the four cups in reverse so you guys have a lot of opportunities in your present moment so let go of the past in order to move forward in your present moment your memory could be something that is very important holding memories keeping memories like keeping the happy memories. so documenting things is going to be very important for your journey and spirit is saying that's why they want you to slow down or that's why certain things in your life are slowing down for you so that you guys can document them in order to share your progress share your story because your story is something that is meant to be seen or it's meant to inspire other people in the long run so spirit is saying document that so if you haven't started like a youtube channel or some sort of like social media site or even like taking like pictures or videos or something like that even if it's for yourself spirit is saying do that even if it's like for yourself in order to look back at it and see how far you guys have come and eventually make like a book or like a video diary or like a mini movie for yourself or your family the people that are close to you like spirit is saying it's gonna help somebody else in the long run and that's why you guys may be moving forward in the way that you guys are you guys feel like the progress that you guys are making is not enough and so you guys may be working yourself a lot harder but spirit is saying things have slowed down in order for you guys to document them okay and spirit is saying that you guys need to ground yourself and step into your individuality so you guys are in this energy of where you guys need to stand out or it's important for you guys to stand out because the more that you guys stand out the more that people are going to be drawn to you and it's important for people to be drawn to you especially in this point in your journey right now so spirit is saying you guys need to do the things that are for you right now to see the opportunities that you guys have and take action towards those opportunities okay 
and with the next card i have the card the eight of cups so like i said before you guys need to do some reflection or you guys need to look back on your memories that you guys have made and see how you guys can implement the strategy that you guys used in your past in your present moment to get you a lot farther but like spirit is saying work smarter not harder okay use your time wisely so that you guys are not burning yourself out okay like there's a memory that you guys need to reflect on and change your perspective on it in order to move forward and let go of the negativity around it because once you guys let go of the negativity around it you guys are going to be able to find the clarity within it or gain this like breakthrough and move forward and with the star card you guys are definitely in your healing era or you guys are healing right now from like a difficult situation in your life from the past and that's what i'm getting like you guys are overcoming your past by focusing on your present moment and focusing on what is for you in your present moment in order to gain this stability and spirit is saying as of right now you guys need to heal yourself and take time to rest and rejuvenate and really come into this energy of like balance or i'm hearing the word tranquility so you guys need to find that within yourself in order to rebirth into this better version of yourself okay like you guys need to slow down and smell the roses that's what spirit is saying to enjoy your healing journey because you guys are definitely going to be reflecting the healing that you guys have done on the outside so your inner beauty is going to show out on the outside which is going to help you guys attract the people that you guys need into your life so i'm getting that you guys can be healers of some kind and you guys are attracting people that are in need of healing so spirit is saying you guys need to balance out yourself so that you guys could help these people but also like help yourself okay and with the next card i have the hermit card so you guys definitely need to go into this energy of introspection and see what you guys need to heal and see the opportunities that you guys need to take in your present moment and also work on your self-esteem because i'm getting that you guys could be very shy or it's something that is keeping you in this one place in your life or keeping you kind of stagnant and spirit is saying you guys need to let that go in order to reach this breakthrough like it's time for a breakthrough that's what spirit is saying and reflecting and seeing how you guys have come this far is going to help you move forward in your present moment so spirit is saying you guys need to ground yourself in order to take action towards things that are for your highest good and you guys are doing a lot of manifesting so spirit is saying like you guys need to take time out in order to enjoy your present moment and enjoy yourself to see how far you guys have come okay like enjoy the opportunities that you guys have in your present moment and reflect on those opportunities that you guys have already had and learn from those okay and with the next card i have the ace of pentacles so you guys are definitely receiving your manifestation or you guys are really great at manifesting things in your life so spirit is saying be mindful of that be mindful that you guys can have anything that you guys want in your life and it takes you to take action towards it even if that action is taking an opportunity that you guys didn't expect to turn into something really major like spirit is saying do that but also make sure that you guys are taking opportunities from people that you guys actually trust or trust your intuition and ask for guidance towards the right people places and environments and ask for guidance to be in alignment with your manifestations as well okay and with the next card, I have the Hierophant. So there's something that you guys are doing or something that you guys are about to do that involves you guys needing to trust your intuition or needing to take the proper steps or kind of be in this like traditional role okay like maybe you guys are doing something that is very traditional and you guys need to kind of stick into the traditional way or use your individuality in order to stand out in certain situations that 
kind of cause you to be more traditional like spirit is saying like you guys could be traditional but you guys could also have your own way of doing things and spirit is saying like make sure you guys like sprinkle your individuality in every single thing that you guys do in order to be remembered okay like in order to leave your mark on the world okay and with the devil card in reverse you guys are definitely going through a breakthrough so spirit is saying you guys need to spend time alone in order to heal yourself from difficult situations that happened to you in your past in order to heal your self-esteem and build up your confidence and kind of re-motivate you to take action because maybe you guys are taking a lot of action and again you guys are not seeing the results that you guys want to see as of right now and spirit is saying you guys need to reflect on your journey and kind of take some time to enjoy your journey in order to gain this breakthrough in your present moment okay it's like you're so busy that you guys don't see the opportunities that you guys have in your present moment or you guys don't see the work that you guys have already put in and you guys don't see that the work that you guys have done even in the past has paid off in your present moment okay and with the priestess of light oracle cards i have the cards courage it says strength fearlessness and family so you guys definitely could be a leo or have leo in your chart and you guys need to step into that confidence, step into that leadership energy in order to move forward in your present moment and motivate other people to do the same, okay? So you guys definitely have the strength to move forward in your present moment. You guys may not believe that at this time. The Spirit is saying you guys do and you guys need to look within yourself and continue to keep going. But make sure that you guys balance out your workload because maybe that's the problem, okay? And with the next card i have the card idyllic times this is the garden in paradise so you guys are in need of listening to your inner wisdom because i'm getting that you guys may go back and forth from like listening to your intuition and then like kind of ignoring your intuition or kind of getting stuck in past memories or past thoughts like the past version of yourself and how the past version of yourself thought in the past and spirit is saying you guys need to ground yourself and when you guys get to that point just know that you guys need to cleanse your energy because i'm getting that you guys could absorb a lot of people's energy around you and when you guys absorb a lot of people's energy around you you guys may also be able to kind of catch up on their thought process or what they're thinking or how they feel about themselves and you guys may be picking up on that and you guys are like i've already healed from this why do i keep thinking about this and it may be the people that you guys are around you guys need to cleanse your energy from those people or you guys need to spend time alone to cleanse yourself or to refocus on yourself because maybe you guys have been focusing too much on other people you guys haven't had time to focus on yourself so spirit is saying take this time to redirect the focus on you in order to receive your manifestations because spirit is saying like it's time for you to focus on you it's time for you guys to be in this energy of transformation and in order for you guys to do that you guys need to focus on yourself and also pour back into yourself okay and with the next card i have the card circle of eternal joy it says timelessness in dance of life so you guys could be doing something that is very timeless or something that is kind of traditional but you guys are doing it in a very unique way that's what i'm getting like you guys could be following kind of like a traditional path but you guys are making it your own so you guys could be doing something very spiritual and it's taking a very long time but spirit is saying you guys need to balance out your ego in order for you guys to move forward and document what you guys have learned on your journey it's something about documentation that is something very important or you guys need to read more or it's something that you guys are going to get from a document that is going to kind of ground you again you guys could be in need of reading more or just being more present and also being in this energy of where you can do things alone like spirit is saying it's okay to do things alone maybe you guys need to do things alone in order to learn from the situation a little bit faster okay and 
with the power of love oracle deck i have the card expression so spirit is saying you guys definitely need to express yourself a lot more and that's what i'm getting like documentation is going to be something very important like maybe you guys need to express yourself in some sort of like writing dancing singing it could be through like a video diary or However you guys want to express yourself, like Spirit is saying you guys need to do that in order to cleanse up your throat chakra, but you guys need to have the courage to take that leap of faith in doing so, okay? If you guys need to transform this negative energy into something positive, that's what I'm getting. Like you guys need to move forward in a way that helps you gain your power back like spirit is saying take your power back with how you guys move forward in your present moment okay and with the moonology cards i have the card a win-win outcome is forecast it says full moon in libra you guys could be a libra or have libra in your chart or you guys are just gaining this justice in your life in order to move forward in your present moment and step into your individuality maybe something very traditional in your past was keeping you stuck or keeping you from healing and spirit is saying it's time to gain more information about yourself or learn things about yourself in order to move forward in your present moment okay like maybe something that you guys have learned in the past is no longer working for you and spirit is saying you guys need to learn something else in order to see what can work for you okay and that's when you guys will start to see this balance come into your life when you guys start to rediscover yourself maybe you guys need to go on the self-discovery journey and kind of find yourself like kind of find what you guys like to do and kind of start from scratch like spirit is saying like you guys need to date yourself in order to see what you guys like in order to see what you guys like alone like spirit is saying do it alone so you guys don't have any other energies interfering and with the next card, I have the card, take time to breathe out. So I'm getting that you guys could be working a lot or you guys could be working very hard and you guys need to take time to yourself. That's what I'm getting. Like you guys need to take time to practice self-love, reflect and rebalance yourself, dance, sing, like enjoy life, okay? Because you guys have been working so hard and now it's time for you guys to celebrate. Like it's time for you guys to celebrate life. It's time for you guys to celebrate the things that you guys have done already, okay? And with the next card, I have the card, nothing will come out of the situation. So whatever you guys are thinking is going to ruin what you guys have built for yourself. Like, especially if it's something that is very creative, especially if it's something that is for your highest good, nothing is going to ruin what is for you. So if you guys take a break to rediscover yourself, you guys are not going to ruin what you guys have built for you, okay? Spirit is saying it's actually going to help you in the long term. So with the last card, I have the card, car out of control or speeding. So you guys may need to take another direction in life. Like Spirit is saying, there may be a situation where you guys need to rebalance yourself or just take another path. Like you guys may be done with a different chapter in your life. You guys may need to close the door, lock it and throw away the key in order to go towards this path that you guys have been wanting to go towards to discover yourself okay so you guys are definitely going into the right path and you guys may be confused right now but spirit is saying you guys are going to start seeing the situation for what it truly is in the long term or in the future okay so with that being said, that was you guys' reading. If this reading resonated with you guys, make sure you comment down below. Also, if you guys are going to choose another pile, I will see you soon. But if you guys are going to click off this reading, make sure you guys like, share, and subscribe to my channel. See you guys next time and bye y'all. Hey, pile number three, welcome to your reading. So before I get into your cards or anything, I'm gonna tell you why you chose this Smoky Quartz Crystal. With this crystal, I'm getting that you guys could be a water sign, so Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio, or you guys could have heavy Scorpio placements in your chart. I'm also getting that you guys could be a Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo, so you guys could be an Earth sign. I'm getting that you guys could have heavy Capricorn placements in your chart. And I'm also getting that you guys could be a Fire sign. So 
Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, and I'm getting that you guys can have heavy Sagittarius placements in your chart. But right now, you guys are going through this change of where you guys need to step into your willpower, okay? So a lot of things are happening in your life of where you guys are being cleansed of any people, places, and situations that are no longer for you. So you guys may get the urge to block certain people, or you guys may get the urge of where you guys just need to move or you guys want to move or you're getting this urge to go out of your comfort zone and do something that is very bold very you like you guys need to step out of your comfort zone and be your unique self that's what spirit is saying in order to gain this recognition that you guys deserve you guys are transmuting a lot of negative energy and turning it into something positive so you guys are turning your pain into power and spirit is saying at this time you guys need to be patient with yourself and really step into this energy of balance and willpower in order to get things done but also like in your present moment like spirit is saying make sure that you guys are grounded and that's what i'm getting with the capricorn energy is that you guys need to ground yourself and think things through in order to create a practical plan to move forward in your life instead of trying to do things that are very impulsive okay so spirit is saying you guys need to think things out before you guys do them because you guys are in this chapter of where your actions are very important or the actions that you guys take are going to be very important so spirit is saying ground yourself think about things also be in this energy of like calmness like allow your soul to be calm like move forward in the energy of your soul instead of your pride like spirit is saying do not let pride control you like if you guys need help you guys need to ask for help especially in this new chapter like there may be a lot of things that you guys need to ask for help on and spirit is saying you guys need to let go of your pride and just ask for help like it's okay to ask for help and when you guys ask for help it's actually going to help with your transformation a lot quicker than if you guys would have figured it out by yourself like it's okay to ask other people that know what they're doing for help okay and spirit is saying ask the right people for help so spirit is saying do not ask people that have no idea what they're doing in their journey help for your journey so for example do not ask people for financial advice when you guys know that that person has no type of financial stability in their lives you're just saying you guys need to ask somebody who is financially stable for financial help okay that's what spirit is saying and spirit is also saying protect your peace from a lot of people i'm getting like family members friends or ex-friends or ex-lovers that are trying to get into your business and be nosy ground yourself because these people are not for you and they're not for your highest good they're just trying to know your information or gain this information to spread it around okay so it's pretty saying be mindful of that and it's not to say that you guys have to be secretive or don't tell anybody anything but spirit is saying be mindful about who you guys tell your business to because at this point in your life you guys don't need a lot of people spreading your business or you guys don't need a lot of drama okay that's what i'm getting you guys are getting out of this energy of drama or the people that are starting a lot of drama in your life are leaving your life in order to help you gain this mental clarity and this peace of mind okay so with that being said let's get into your overall energy and i use the light oracle deck and i have the card rainbow fluorite it says focus productivity and creativity so it's pretty saying you guys need to focus on what is important to you at this time so like i said before you guys are letting go of any people or spirit is taking people out of your life in order for you guys to regain this focus on what is for you and what is for your highest good so that you guys can move forward in this more productive energy spirit is saying you guys need to have a routine or system for yourself so that you guys can get things done in a timely manner in order for you guys to move forward in your present moment spirit is saying organization is going to be something that is very important because the more organized that you guys are the more that you guys can get done in a day so spirit is saying if you guys write like a simple to-do list for the day you guys are actually going to be more focused on those tasks at hand than if you guys were to just wake up and be like oh, i think i'll do this today like spirit is saying it's time for you guys to decide on what you guys want to do every single day in order to move forward in a very 
focused and creative way like spirit is saying you guys could be creative with what you guys are doing in your present moment it's more so like once you figure out what you guys want to do then you guys can add your creativity to that but spirit is saying you guys need to decide on what is for you so i'm getting like a libra energy of where you guys could be very indecisive spirit is saying once you know what you guys want then take action towards that okay and with your tarot cards i have the card the moon cards there may be a lot of things that are unknown or things that may not make sense to you at this time but it's more so like you guys need to figure out what you guys want and do a little bit of some introspection in order to cleanse out this energy that is keeping you stagnant or keeping you kind of in this brain fog or confusion about what you guys want spirit is saying you guys need to let go of other people's opinions as well in order to move forward in the energy that is unique to you okay because spirit is saying once you move forward in your authentic energy you guys are going to be able to trust your intuition and trust what is for you like spirit is saying you guys need to really tap into your intuition and focus on what is for you what is for your highest good what you guys want out of life and you guys really need to do some self-discovery that's what i'm getting as well you guys can be a cancer or have cancer in your chart like i said before but you guys need to like really trust your intuition and gain this inner strength and willpower to move forward without needing anybody's opinion on how you guys are moving forward or what you guys are moving forward with okay because spirit is saying certain people haven't surpassed the level that you guys are at and it's not to say you guys are higher than somebody or they're lower than you or anything like that it's more so that you guys are in a different path and these people haven't got to that path yet and so if you ask them how to move forward they wouldn't know <laughs> If you guys ask them how to move forward, they wouldn't know what to do. So Spirit is saying be mindful of that. Like be mindful that there are certain people that haven't even gone through the path of where you're trying to be at. So if you're asking them for help, it wouldn't make any sense because they haven't got to that place. So they can't even imagine what to do. They can't even tell you what to do, okay? And with the next card, I have the card the lovers so you guys could be a gemini or have gemini in your chart or you guys could be meeting a gemini that is going to help inspire you to get back into alignment but spirit is saying in order to get back into alignment you guys need to trust your intuition and protect your peace so cut off any people places and situations that no longer serve you or regain this confidence to manifest what you guys want to manifest okay because i'm getting that there's something that you guys want that other people around you haven't got to yet or they haven't got to see anybody do it yet so they can't imagine what you guys are doing spirit is saying you guys need to kind of take a break from these people and really focus on what you guys want and redirect your attention to what you guys want in your present moment what is for you in your present moment and spirit is saying the more opinions that you guys have about what you guys want to do the more confused that you guys are going to be so spirit is saying you guys need to focus on your opinion the most or what you guys want the most in order to see it in your present moment that's what i'm getting okay and you guys may need to introspect in order to get yourself back into alignment and in order to create the stability on the outside because you guys are already stable on the inside like you guys are already a very stable person a very emotionally stable person and spirit is saying you guys need to move forward in that energy and trust yourself and trust your intuition okay and with the next card i have the seven of pentacles so spirit is saying seeds that you guys have planted are going to be fruitful you guys just need to maintain them okay they're just saying you guys are in the season of where you guys need to maintain what you guys have built already and you guys don't really need to do anything too much like it's more so like just maintaining your strategy maintaining 
what you guys have already built watering what you guys have already built speaking life into what you guys have already built in order to move forward in a very positive manner okay do not listen to anybody else's opinion that is not helping you move forward spirit is saying if you guys continue to listen to other people's opinions that do not matter it's going to keep you in this energy of stagnation and it's only going to help your doubts and spirit is saying you guys have the power to change those doubts into something very positive okay something to motivate you guys even if it's like a negative thought you guys can change that into something that is going to motivate you to do better to promote yourself that's what i'm getting like spirit is saying promote yourself more even if other people do not like when you guys promote yourself spirit is saying it's going to pay off in the long run because it doesn't matter what these people like it matters what you guys like okay because i'm getting that you guys may be very stuck on other people's opinions or you guys may be like very in your head about how other people are going to feel about what you guys are doing or what you guys are already doing so spirit is saying you guys need to really align yourself with who you guys want to be and continuing to water yourself or continuing to pour into yourself at this time and with the next card i have the card the chariot card so step into this willpower and do the things that you guys can in your present moment and spirit is saying again organization is going to be something that is very important to you you guys are coming into this energy of where you're very happy with your life or you're very happy with the transformation that you guys have done already so spirit is saying continue to be in that energy because it's going to help you realign yourself and really focus on what you guys want instead of what other people want from you okay because what other people want from you is not going to help you stay in like this sole purpose and that's what spirit wants for you and that's what you guys truly want for yourself is to stay in your soul's purpose so that you guys can actually be happy within yourself so that you guys can actually be happy Happy. and spirit is saying the happiness is already within yourself so once you guys realize that you guys are going to be able to be in alignment and take action towards what you guys want and also be steady with how you guys take action be more consistent with how you guys take action okay and with the next card i have the queen of swords so spirit is saying you guys need to step in your power and saying what you guys want to say instead of holding back and it's not to say just go around and be rude but spirit is saying you guys need to say what is on your mind in a very intelligent way okay and spirit is saying you guys are already intelligent you guys already have the intelligence to move forward and where you guys want to go it's more so that you guys need to use your voice and speak up in situations that people are trying to purposely put you down in maybe you guys have the qualities for something and maybe somebody is telling you that you guys don't and it's not to say that you guys have to show them that you guys have the qualities but you guys need to stand up for yourself and just take action towards things or opportunities that are for your highest good okay I'm getting that you guys have the quality to be in a leadership position but you guys are listening to somebody else's negative projections on you and it's not helping you guys move forward so spirit is saying like step into your leadership energy know what you guys are capable of move forward in that energy so that you guys can move forward in alignment and with the ace of wands i'm getting that you guys are on the verge to inspire people or you guys are already inspiring people with what you guys are doing so if you guys continue to water yourself you guys are going to continue to water what is for you in your life okay so spirit is saying as you guys pour into yourself you guys are going to pour into society in a positive way and manifest the things that you guys want okay so you guys are coming into like this very calming energy of where you guys don't have to do too much to inspire other people or do too much to make things happen in your life okay it's more so like you guys need to use that willpower to stand up for what you guys believe in and continue to move forward in your present moment and not let anybody tell you what you're capable of okay because spirit is saying if you guys let somebody tell you what you're capable of you guys are never going to be the person that you guys were meant to be and spirit is saying you don't want to be in that energy because you're going to be full of regret and you guys don't want to be in that regretful energy okay so you guys are cleansing a lot of those people who kind of put you down or in your new chapter that you guys are going towards it's more so like you guys are going to take back your power from the people that kind of made you stay in a box 
or people that encouraged you to stay in a box you guys are going to be taking your power back by being more inspiring to the people around you okay and with the priestess of light oracle cards i have the cards Setting boundaries. It says threshold protection and honor. So you guys definitely need to set boundaries with these people that are trying to keep you in a box or trying to tell you what you guys are capable of. And Spirit is saying set healthy boundaries with these people in order to move forward in a way that is for you and in a way that is aligned with who you guys were meant to be because we're just saying you guys are your brand and a part of being your brand is the way that you guys communicate with people and we're just saying it's okay to come off a little bit bossy when you guys know what you guys are capable of or when you guys know what you guys want we're just saying do not settle for anything less because other people want you to settle or just because other people want you to stay in that box it's okay to expand yourself more than what other people feel like it's for you okay and with the next card i have the card achievement it says ever plus intention so you guys are on the verge to achieving something very big in your life and again you guys need to have the willpower and the strength to move forward and kind of ground yourself that's what i'm getting like spirit is saying what is about to come is something very big something that you guys have been working on for a very long time and it's something that's going to be kind of unexpected but you guys knew that it was coming it's like unexpected but you guys knew that it was coming like the timing is unexpected but you guys knew that it was coming like you guys knew that it was something that has been in the works for a very long time or you guys have been working on something for a very long time and when you guys achieve it it's going to be something that is kind of out of the blue and Spirit is saying you guys need to be focused on just pouring into yourself, pouring into your projects and the things that are helping you stay in alignment, okay? You guys could be a Taurus or have Taurus in your chart, but I'm getting that you guys also need to celebrate where you guys are right now in order to be in alignment, okay? And with the next card, I have the card Harvest. It's this gathering of blessings. So you guys are definitely getting your manifestation or gaining something that has been worked on for a very long time i'm getting that you guys could be gaining the confidence to move forward or you guys could be achieving something achieving something very big or spirit is saying be open to your manifestations or be open to meeting new people going to new places stepping out of your comfort zone so that you guys can receive your manifestations and receive these blessings that you guys are worthy of okay because spirit is saying once you step out of your comfort zone you guys are going to be able to be open to more also being more present okay? spirit is saying once your attention is fully in your present moment you guys are going to be able to receive what you guys have been waiting for it is also saying get out of this energy of waiting because what you guys want is already here and with the power of love oracle card i have the card respect you guys are definitely gaining a lot more respect in your present moment because of what you guys are doing you're just saying you guys need to balance yourself because what is coming in your life is going to be something very big and it's gonna put you into this leadership energy so spirit is saying they want you to get out of your pride in order to gain this respect okay and with the moonology cards i have the card bring love into the situation it says new moon in aquarius you guys could have aquarius placements in your chart but spirit is saying you guys need to step into your uniqueness and step into this energy of love and doing things with love and when i say doing things with love it's more so like you're doing things with a unique twist to it so you're doing things that really say you it's maybe doing things that are trendy but you guys may be putting your unique twist onto it or spirit is saying do that so that you guys can stand out spirit is saying the more that you guys put your unique twist on to the things that you guys are doing the more that you guys are going to stand out in your field okay and with the next card add the card dreams need a practical plan it says full moon in taurus so you guys may need to organize yourself a little bit better in order to move forward in a very balanced way and 
also calm your nerves a little bit so spirit is saying once you organize yourself or keep yourself organized you guys are going to be able to move forward in a very calm way because you guys know what is coming up next and it's also going to help you like step out of your comfort zone more because you guys will know what you guys are meant to do next okay and with the card surrender to the divine it says full moon so with this card i'm getting that you guys need to let go of your control of the situation in order to harvest your blessings so it's pretty saying let go of the control that you guys may have had on timing or may have had on certain people coming into your life so we're just saying let that go in order for you guys to receive what is for your highest good okay because we're just saying it may be something better coming into your life than what you guys want okay and with the last card i have the card insects and reptiles so with this card i'm getting that you guys need to overlook a lot of negativity that has happened in the past in order to move forward in your present moment if anybody has tried to put you down or try to tell you that you guys were not capable of doing something spirit so is saying you guys need to let that go in order for you guys to like show yourself that you guys were worthy of this balance or worthy of whatever you guys are asking the universe for because something that you guys have asked for is coming but it's something bigger okay like something bigger and better so spirit is saying be open to that so with that being said that was you guys this reading if this reading resonated with you guys make sure you comment down below also make sure you guys like share and subscribe to my channel see you guys next time and bye y'all